Hi everybody, now this is a super important video for anybody who's got a USB plug and play mic plugged into their laptop or their PC and are having trouble with it being too quiet. And this is a real common problem with USB mics. So it's not really a problem, they're designed that way so that you can't um, you, you, you can't be shouting into them, so, you, so you're really close to the mic. Um, and, and overwhelming the mic so it starts clipping but this is very solvable you've probably gone into the settings you know you've probably gone down here you've probably opened up um, the sound settings you've probably put the input volume up to 100 and still when you do a recording the mic is too quiet now what I need to do uh, let's just crack on so I can show you what you've got to do this is the guy who showed me how to do it so it's a YouTube channel called tech it out so I'll put a link to this guy's channel in the YouTube description so go over there and subscribe um, because it took me a while to find his video and he says it took him a while to find this out so you know big kudos to take it out well done sir brilliant you've solved a problem that I've I've struggled with for a long long time so what you do is you on his on his video he, he links to two um, two programs and again I'll put the links to these down in the YouTube description down, down below the first one is called equalizer APO a system-wide equalizer for Windows 7 8, 8.1 so what you want to do is you want to download this and you want to install it right don't run it just download it install it I think well you might run it but anyway it asks you to restart your computer but but don't do that so you install that one then you download and run piece equalizer as well all right and install that and then what you want to do is restart your laptop restart your PC because that's part of the process once you've done that You'll end up with a um, probably a shortcut on your shortcut on your depth deck a shortcut on your desktop to a program called Peace, and this this is the bit of magic that that you need. Let's just fire it up so you can see it, and you can choose whether to have a simple interface or the full. Full full's pretty cool, you know. Click on that one, and here we have it. This now this looks very complicated, but it's not. What you're interested in is at the top here, okay? This preamplifier. So what this do, what this does, is this boosts the output of your mic um, at a system level. All right. So to kind of show that, what I'll do is I'll keep talking once, and I'll 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 change the this uh, this level so we can make it quieter. So one, two, three, four, five, six. Eight, nine, ten, and then we can make it louder as well. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, and then we're back to where we started. Now, that, for me, this is amazing, um, and this is changing the mic's input levels at a, si at a system level. So before it goes through anything else as well. Um, so this means that, uh, for example, um, when you're recording into Audacity or you're recording into OBS or you're doing a Skype phone call or doing anything like that, this will boost the mic before it goes into that program. So especially with things like Skype and, um, and, uh, and, and video calling software, um, where you you know you go up to 100 and that's it, but you're still too quiet. This will make it louder. Now you do have to be careful because this does allow you to start the mic clipping and the sound will go down. What I found is that if you go up to around 4,000 between four th halfway between 4,000, so that is. If you go between 13 and 20 uh, dBs extra, uh, that will that will do. Now, I'm recording this little uh, tutorial using OBS, and OBS actually has a mic um, a booster built into it, so I've boosted my mic already. Um, and, and and basically, and then all you do is you say you're done, and that that is then saved. It doesn't matter what program you use with your USB mic, you will have that setting. So so that's great. Um, you know, job done kind of thing. You've now got a louder USB mic on your laptop or your PC. Now, the next step you may want to take is if you look down in the bottom left hand corner, 
you can see we've got lots of settings that you can go to. Um, you've got lots of uh, presets that we can change. Here it goes as it does it to give you different sounds in the mic as well. And you can save these. And as you can see, so these are all the different frequencies across the mic. You know, the frequencies you're down from very low to very high. And you can adjust the gain on each of those levels. Now, I've kind of gone for uh, bass boost uh, is the one to kind of try, try and make my voice sound a little bit deeper. In fact, what I'll do is if I change it, let's change it to radio just see what that does see what you can hear see if you can hear any change again i'm not really gonna you probably won't hear much change with that one um, but let's go back to bass boost and then what you can do with this is you can also um you can then save that as well and you could save it and give it a different name so i've got bass boost xbox is is basically the the preset i use what what, what i mean by xbox is this is for when i'm streaming using um using my laptop and my xbox together so as you can see it boosts up the low end a little bit and boosts up the high end a tiny little bit so there we go problem solved usb mics too quiet not anymore um, now, where you probably won't want to use this is on a mic that you can plug in via USB that's got a gain controller on the mic. So, so plenty of um, more higher end stuff does. But if it doesn't, this, well, it's solved the problem. Anyway, that's enough from me. Click um, subscribe down below, click the notifications icon, click like if this was useful, put your questions in the comments down below, and I will see you again soon.